Hello everyone, I am the MXC player and welcome back to The Legend of Zelda Skyward Sword. I just randomly jumped into the lava. Uh, anyways, last time uh, we got the Magma Mid and started burying our way on the ground. And, uh, yeah, we've, uh, that's pretty much it. We also got a heart piece from one of the Magmas we encountered. Thus completing another heart container. So there are only so there's only one heart container left, as well as eight heart pieces remaining. Yep. So now that we've created this flow of lava, we can now ride this one. Bridge of Decision. Choose the path you believe in. Move forward bravely. Uh, uh, we're gonna go this way first. Just to make sure. Oh, we can't even go this way anyway. All right, never mind. We're ah. Okay, so we have to go this way. It seems. All right. We were told something about uh two monsters. Oh, I forget how to do this. Wait, I saw jewels up there. Will this do anything? No. Oh, no, nope, I didn't mean to do that. Uh. Why did you not freaking dive down, Link? Okay, maybe I should start from right here. There we go. Okay, so you gotta land on here. Okay. Ooh. Another goddess wall. I think that I can activate. I'm not even gonna attempt to draw on that for some reason. Uh. So the bombs appear only like, oh god, two cursed Lazafels, really? Uh. Oh shit. Ah! Oh. Uh, no, don't pick up the freaking thing while I'm in the middle of combat! Anyways, as I was saying, um, draw, getting bombs requires you to draw a circle. When I was attempting to draw the heart, the game for some reason decided to register that as a circle. So I don't know what was going on there. Alright. So we move on. Over here. <laughs> Climb these stairs. What's over here? Oh! Curse keys! Another goddess wall already? Or is this a, a Sheikah stone? Wow! Two right next to each other, how generous. You know what, since you're practically begging me to, I might as well draw rupees. So, 
gonna start from That looks atrocious. Well, at least I got what I wanted. Although I would have preferred red rupees. Screw you. to each statue in accordance with the number of wings each possesses, from least to most. When light resides in each statue, the king's treasure shall be yours. So we gotta light these things up. Um... Okay, so that's zero... One. Oh, uh, caterpillars. Oh, I can't break through that. Let's deactivate it now. Oh, uh, well, there doesn't seem to be a way to get that unless. Um. I don't know if this will activate the switch or not. No, it won't. Alright. Two. Three. simple. We have a mid-boss fight in this caterpillar thing, which, by the way, once again, is very annoying to fight. I missed. Ah! Woo! It sees me! Oh! Woo! Which way is he turning? Oh! Oh! No! No, you don't. You don't. You don't see me. Oh, oh. Where are you going? You're going that way. It seems. Damn it. Okay. Oh. No! Don't turn that way. Oh wait. I was supposed to turn that way. Ah. Tricky. I don't like that. Oh, now you go that way. Between turning this way so I can go over here. It's Christ. Oh no! Get away! Ah! Oh. I thought I could be clever. Oh! Ooh. This guy's very annoying. 
There we go. Jeez. Ah. That's what I get for saying it was simple. Oh my god. Emerge from this hellhole, please. You got the mysterious crystals. This mass is made up of faintly glowing square crystals. Several are missing. That one's not even connected to anything. There's a piece that's not connected to anything. It's really weird. So... We'll just move on from that. Problem is I can go ahead and take out for no reason. See if they drop anything. Now will you drop something? The answer is no. Well, that's all right. Um. Yeah, we're good right now. All that's left is to insert this key. fast. Link, I see you're still among the living. Fancy meeting you here. We seem to bump into each other time and time again. Oh, it's no coincidence, though, is it? You and I, we're bound by a thread of fate. <laughs> Look at these old drawings! Until I found these, I was upset about that little stunt of the goddess's guard dog. Pulled at the gate of time. What was the twig's name again? Impa? Well, never mind that. Because these drawings suggest the existence of a second time. Gate of time. This news has just filled my heart with rainbows. I've been a busy boy searching here and there and everywhere for another gate of time. And yet, I couldn't even find a single clue. Since I know I can be honest with you, I'll admit I got a little soaky. It was frowns all around. The thought of never getting my hands on that darling young girl again was, well, more than I could bear. But then, then I found this place. The prospect of a second gate of time has made me positively giggly. <laughs> that girl, your adorable friend, she will be instrumental in bringing about the revival of my master. And though I feared she was now quite beyond my reach, I despair no longer! But before we talk any further on that subject, there's still the matter, outstanding matter of your punishment, Link. Do you remember when I told you that the next time we met, I'd make your ears bleed from the sound of your own screams? Well, I've been thinking, 
Perhaps corporal punishment is a touch harsh. I might be willing to forgive and forget if you'll strike a deal. All I ask is that you tell me where I can find the other gate of time. That's not too much to ask, is it? Oh, and don't you play coy with me. I know that you know. So why not let me in on the fun? Such behavior. A mischievous boy like you needs to be dealt with firmly. I must warn you, I won't keep... Go easy on you this time. <laughs> Lovely, aren't they? You'll find the supple skin of my arms tougher than any armor. Doesn't their shape just leave you breathless? <laughs> Behold! Such beauty! Such a pure form! Such an exquisite physique! Such stunning features! Yes, I've pretty much got it all. Though there is one teensy thing that I lack. <laughs> Namely, mercy. Come to me, Link. You and I were bound by that thread of fate destined to fight. So come close, Link. Meet me in battle, and the thread of fate that binds us will be soaked crimson with your blood. Sorry again for my poor reading skills. So, yeah. Basically the same fight as before. Uh... For some reason Link is not holding his rear remote. Right there. What the? Why didn't you parry, Link? There we go. Yeah. Shit. Now I bring down two swords this time. Demon Lord! It shouldn't matter how powerful your sword is, you are still nothing, not just a human, a human child, and yet you prevail! You filthy scamp, 
You have awakened the wrath that will burn for eons. I swear to you, whatever it takes, I will drag you into eternity of torment! <laughs> well, we certainly pissed someone off, didn't we? Got a heart container. Your life has increased by one. Alright, now all that's left are those eight heart pieces. Flames of Din have imbued your blade with the sacred white light that demons revile. Master, now that it has been tempered with the last of the sacred flames, your blade has finally revealed its true form. You now hold the Master Sword. With this sword's great power, you can awaken the gate of time within the sealed temple. I recommend you make your way to this location. do that right now um cuz I am definitely scared of what will happen once we head back to the sealed grounds so instead uh, I don't know why I'm walking all, all, all the way over here I can just go over here and uh, check around to see uh, uh, what I can do now that we've cleared uh, the fire sanctuary Goddess cubes or goddess chests to be found. Um. Oh, I don't think I can do anything right now because I haven't gone to the sale grounds just yet. I don't want to go there just yet. What else can I do right now? Uh, Beatles Island. Found woods. What I 
Yeah, there's literally nothing else I can do right now. Shit. I was hoping I, I could at least, like, hold off until, like, next episode to do that. But apparently not. So many limited options. Uh, let's go to the lobby of pumpkin and see if I can finally find wherever the hell that other goddess chest is. So, I, that thing's still bothering the hell out of me. So I might as well spend the rest of this episode trying to find it. off. Oh my god, I didn't see that. Okay, looks like I have to land on the roof. Here you are. Jeez, finally. The gold rupee. Don't tell anyone. I'm gonna tell everyone that I found a gold rupee. Uh, okay. I was expecting it to be a little longer, but I found it pretty quick. Oh, wait! I can talk to you now! <coughs> oh, thanks for helping me carry the pumpkins the other day. Thanks to you, we're ready to plant the new seeds. The only thing is... Plowing the patch so that it's ready to be planted as hard work. If only there was someone who was really good at plowing the field. I know someone. Really? If that's the case, I'd love to ask this person to help me out. If you find this person, please tell them to come find me right away, okay? I calculate a 90% chance that this request is in... Stunning ability. Oh, okay. So, begin to take the person. Okay, so, we gotta set... Uh, yes. So, we are able to douse for the individual who can plow the pumpkin patch. Is there really someone who would help me out? Well, I'll try to keep my hopes up and just wait here patiently until they show up. You know what that means? Yeah. Back to Elden Volcano! Because we know the Magmas are really good at digging, so... So why don't we head over there? We'll start at the fire sanctuary. Alright, so you're up there. <laughs> Thank you. 
So you're still out there somewhere, it seems. Don't want to deal with you guys. Don't want to deal with you morons either. Okay, so you're all the way out here, it seems. Wait down there, really? Jeez. Well, at least here I can get some rupees. Mm. More blue rupees. Missed one again. So you're all the way over there. Great. More of you freaks. I heard a I heard an item drop. There we go. Monster Claw. Not sure if I need these anymore. Oh, there's a big boy right there. There's a big boy. Big boy. Yep. Now that we have the Master Sword, we're able to deal a hell of a lot more damage. Don't tell me you're all the way down here. Nah, you just drop more arrows. Yeah, you're down here. Dive, Link. Dive. No, you're not the guy. Wait. Are you up there? Is that it? Okay, so I have to dive properly, it seems. Shit. We're gonna go through all this whole thing again. <clears throat> Where's respawning enemies? You know what, I'm just gonna ignore you guys. Alright, so... There you are, you're right there. Shall we meet again, huh? I gotta thank you for your help last time. See, I've been searching for new treasure spots, but I can't find a single bobble or bit of treasure. Maybe I'm just getting woozy from working so long in this heat. Sometimes I wish I could find a dog that really paid to, paid to my strengths, yeah? Something in a cooler climate. Yeah, I wish it. I know a place. <coughs> Sorry, I know a place with work that I'd be good at? And it's in the sky? I love the sky! Where do I sign up? I'm telling you, I'm in. Let's do this thing. This individual's capabilities match perfectly to the types of duties expected of an employee at the Lucky Pumpkin. Do you want to call the robot and transport this individual? Yes, if we must. 
Master, I will send word to the robot using telepathic transmission. <clears throat> and here he is. The asshole robot himself. <laughs> Mr. Spy, I'm here. Zerk. Oh, you want me to carry this old thing? You don't have to tell me twice, Zerk. I'll be waiting for you in the sky, so don't so, so take too long for it. You have long arms or really short legs. Master, I suggest that we also return to the sky and accompany the Magma to its destination quickly. Yes, we will do that. I can finally get the freak out of here. Because this episode's gone on way too long. Frick you. What did you drop? More arrows, it seems. Yeah, more arrows. Alright. There you are. To the sky we go! And all the way back to the freaking lumpy pumpkin with this old geezer. If you're expecting any more um, uh, uh, hard pieces from the Betro side quests, uh, you're most likely not gonna be getting any. You'll just be getting uh, the biggest wallet upgrade there is in the game once you've uh, once you've completed gone all the branching crystals in the game. Go. And here he is. I brought the old Magma Zerg. Send my best to fight Zat. Yeah, you found someone, didn't you? Wait a second. This isn't a person. Huh, so you think that this mole is going to plow the patch for me? Come on, are you seriously trying to get me to work on a field all day? Is that why you hold me all the way up here into the sky? <laughs> well, good luck, Mr. Mole Man. What? But you... Well, I suppose. I guess I can at least give it a try. Hey, so, what do you think? Wow, look at that! That's amazing! <laughs> you think? Well, it was not really. Moving around in the various childfully for us, Magmas. Yeah. Wow, one more time, please. Again, again. Oh, yeah, here I go. I'm so grateful that you brought this lovely guy to help me. I'm going to ask him to help with all kinds of things. Thank you very, very, very much. Five gratitude crystals. Which will probably get us our next reward. Yep. So we only need 20 more left. So that's going to be it for this episode of The Legend of Zelda Skyward Sword. I've been the MXG player. Tell me what you guys thought, and I'll see you guys next time.